All right, welcome back, my students. This is going to be a very short lecture because I want to show you how to pull the owner, the owner of the image. All right, so let's go. Let's get to it. Let's create a row real quick and let's comment this out. And let's create a really cool route here or root. Some people call it root. I call it route, but it's up to you to call it whatever you want. All right, as long as it makes sense. All right, so photo, and let's just say the ID is there. We'll we'll put an ID on the browser. That's fine. Let's just do this, and okay. As a matter of fact, that's photo, and let's just call this user. Actually, post has two, so we can pull out all the the owner of that all right so here what we need to do is we need to loop well not loop but we need to go ahead and query the the photo and we need to say find and it's better that you use this find or fail okay that way you can kind of throw a 404 error there so find or fail ID and I haven't been using that much but when we start building our application we I'm gonna be using this all the time all right so find or fail ID, all right, so we're going to find that, and as a matter of fact, I'm going to apply a variable to it. So that's going to be the photo, okay, as a matter of fact, we need to import it as well, so I'm going to put this on top, import the class, and for those of you that don't have PHP, to make sure that you have this on top, all right, the namespace there. Beautiful. So once we find the photo, we will pull out the owner. So we will say photo owner or something like that. Okay. Image. You can write it however you want. You can write um, photo. Uh, you can write photo owner photo ID owner, whatever you want, but I mean not here, but when you define this, you can do it in your columns, all right? I'm just following conventions, what they have in the documentation, and that's it. As a matter of fact, I don't even need this. I'm just going to return, let me see, return, we don't need ID. We're just going to return like this. We need the name of that method. All right, let me see if I got this correctly. Okay, return photo image image able all right my PHP storm is telling me it has a new version but anyway let's go and try to see if this works if not we'll debug it that's okay so we'll um, come here and say photo ID number one for user oops was a user no it's post I believe all right, there we go. All right, so we found the owner of the photo with ID number one. Cool. What about the owner for ID number two? Who's that? Uh huh. We found photo number two here. Jesus, he has that. <laughs> there we go. See that? Beautiful. All right. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this lecture. I told you it was going to be short and sweet. So as you can see, we were able to find the photo, all right, number one and photo number two owner. So we can see that the photo number two is the owner is a post. And for photo number one, the owner is a user. We just got this uh, confusing URL here, but don't worry about that. All right. Thank you so much for watching, guys and ladies, and I'll see you in the next lecture. Keep it up. You're doing a great job if you're following me. Very good.